Yeah, but at what point has your country become so uh, anti-Christian and secular that we no longer should be listening to the laws of the land because yes, they're that is unjust? Question. Yes, that was a good argument over COVID with the stupid masks and the uh, vaccine mandates. It's when a law is immoral, you are not supposed to follow that law. But with, like with the closing of churches, you know, we had... Um, our churches were closed, not just to congregations, but to priests. Mm. And our church did that, not the government, because the government said, we're closing non-essential services. And the church said, well, we're, we're not essential. essential. What do we do? What's the sacrament? Um, and they said to priests, you can go into the church for maintenance purposes, but you cannot pray while you're there. Oh my goodness. So you can't pray the divine liturgy. You can't pray for your parish. You cannot pray while you're there? Yeah. So the their priority was maintenance over prayer. That's a lack of faith, right? What happened recently with that sh that lady who was uh, arrested outside of an abortion clinic for praying silently? Oh, and what do you do? You know much about I that? I do. Isabel Vaughan Spruce. She's a lovely woman. She heads up the March for Life campaign in the UK, Bless her. and she got arrested for silently praying within the vicinity of an abortion center. So she wasn't directly outside it uh, because we have these new PSPOs. They're called. Uh, it's essentially a buffer zone around an abortion center. And it's because women have a right to kill their babies without being harassed. And we, we've heard this in Parliament. Someone asked the question to the Prime Minister, you know, someone has been arrested for praying silently in their head. This is an infringement of their freedom of worship, mm -hmm. their freedom of expression, freedom of thought. And the Prime Minister said, well, we have to balance that freedom along with the woman's right to health care. First oh, of all, there's that word. Abortion again, is not caring no? for anyone's health. No. But the abortion centre was closed at the time. And prayer is not harassment. So the, the balance is, if there is a balance to be kept, which I would argue there shouldn't be, that balance is way off. Yeah. And Isabel's a good example. I tried to get her on my show for a good two months and the, just the barriers and hurdles that were put in place. This is the spiritual warfare they're up against. But I finally got her on and got that story out there. And she's such a good woman, needs support. Mm. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching that clip. Would you like this beautiful, very high quality, definitely not made in China, not that there's anything wrong with that, Pints with Aquinas Beer Stein for free, sent to your door? Would you also like a copy of The Jill sent to your door four times a year? This is the Pints with Aquinas newspaper, by the way. If you do, go to mattfrad.locals.com and become an annual supporter for any amount. We'll send you that stuff for free and you get a bunch of other free things in return. You'll get more information by going over to mattfrad.locals.com. Thanks.